45-44 here in Madison as Wisconsin ends its two-game skid and hands Minnesota its fourth straight conference defeat. Dave Revs and Sean Morris. Kind of a crazy game shot, a game that literally went down to the final shot of the game. We had a couple good offensive performances, one on each side, though. Austin Holland, or Andre Hollins, I should say, playing very well for the Gophers. And then Trayvon Jackson came up with big shots for Wisconsin. Trayvon Jackson hit a big shot in that uh, huge road win at Indiana, hit a couple down the stretch when Wisconsin needed it. And, Dave, we thought it would be a hard-fought close game and it would come down to foul shooting, and it lived up to that expectation. Well, absolutely did. As we take a look at some of the key plays here, Andre Hollins was great with 20 points in this one. And responding from a subpar performance last time out for the Golden Gophers on the road. And then when they needed it most, Trayvon Jackson, a few possessions prior to that, hit a shot going to his left. Here with the shot clock winding down, able to clear space to his right. And then a weird sequence of events. They lob it up to Mbakwe, who was injured. And by rule, Coach Bo Ryan could select of the four remaining players on the floor when Mbakwe had to go out. He could select who he wanted to shoot the foul shot. Rodney Williams came in shooting 65%, only able to hit one of two. And for the second straight game, foul shooting really bites Minnesota. It hurt them in the loss against Northwestern. Hurts them again here in the final play against Wisconsin as the Badgers win it by the final of 45-44. to They end their losing streak. Minnesota's woes continue. They head home next to take on Nebraska. That's going to do it from the Kohl Center. Have a good one.